I was asked about Sarah Blair and I, I just, here's the thing. Uh, I didn't, uh, since I didn't get into local politics until after she was elected, um, I, when I first heard about her, I thought, you know, oh my gosh, we've got somebody young in there. They're going to shake things up. But no, her dad's a senator. And here's the thing. She's a Republican and she votes Republican. And I don't want to disparage anybody at all that's young, that wants to be involved in politics. I, I think that there are people out there, young people, that are fully capable of doing this job. Sarah Blair, however, is not. Um, she just goes, you know, she, she toes the party line. She votes, you know, Republican. She just votes against us. Uh, and I don't think that... See, here's the thing. When you have a life of privilege, you don't get... Uh, a wide scope of experiences uh, when you don't see the ugly side so you don't see you don't understand what it's like for other people other than herself and, and all she knows is everything that her dad's taught her and and you know what she's you know learned from you know being involved in politics and and she's just she has no idea what it's like for a regular person you know? So, I do not support her. I do not like her in office. Uh, I, I just, it's sad that somebody so young could already be so corrupt, you know? And I don't think, I'm not saying that, you know, she's like taking money or anything like that. I mean, she's, she's just uh, already believes this narrative that everybody's taught her. And she has had, she's shown no uh, interest in in changing her beliefs and so and the way she votes you know it hurts us so I don't think that she should have a job anymore doing what she does neither should her dad neither should like 99% of you know the people that hold office here but I mean like I said I do not want to discourage any young people from beco becoming involved in politics and in government because, you know, we need that here. We need young people. We need, you know, different voices. We need people like that. But we don't need people like Sarah Blair. But that's just how I 